hey, how y'all doing today? Welcome back, Jack. Welcome back. How you been? It's Yen. Today, we're going to talk about Katana. A little bit of that Katana. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't worry, it's a toy. It's a toy. Trust me, it's a toy. <laughs> I promise. Oh, I bought this. I saw this at the store today. I was just walking by and I saw it. I was like, yeah, yeah. It was I was probably it was probably on sale. It was literally a dollar. I was like, yeah, 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 I want that. <laughs> I wanna put it on the wall. I'm going to put this right on the wall. It's going to look real nice. <laughs> it's going to remind me about the last two years. A little little memento. <laughs> well, maybe we bring this out every time we talk about Wax Watch, okay? <laughs> maybe. I don't know yet. We'll see. But I now have... Listen, I now have a rhythm, okay? I have a flavor now. Well, I tell you what. This channel don't take... I don't know if it's going to take off. But it's going to be so insular, okay? It's going to be so <laughs> insular at this point. Ooh, boy, it's like an exclusive club, okay? If you're not on board with the lingo, I don't know, man. This is a whole saga, okay? Listen, there's a lot going on. The last two years, the last year, so much happened. This is a whole different world we live in, okay? It's a whole different world. We live in, in a different kind of future. I thought when we were going to have a future, it was going to be flying cars. It was going to be like domes and different planets, like dome cities, space colonies, like freaking, you know, uh, cyberpunk Neo Tokyo future. That's what I thought we were going to have. Not like this. <laughs> Masktopia. No, thanks. No, thanks. <laughs> Oh, the irony of me making fun of Mask, the name Mask. Anyways, uh, <laughs> oh Lord have mercy, it's like a it's like a real bad dream. Anyways, we got a lot. We got a lot. We wanna kind of slowly. We're just gonna caress a little bit the last year. We're not gonna go too too in depth because we got tonight's show. Okay, we got tonight's show. We got episode one hundred. We got episode one hundred one. Man, and next week, I think I'm going to be doing non-stop episodes. I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm in a rhythm now. I'm in a swing. I'm swinging. That sounds really wrong when I say that. But anyways. So, if you're new. <laughs> if you're new, you probably don't even know what's happening. I apologize. Look, if you're new, okay, welcome to the Zoyan Podcast. We talk about the books the brains, the blockchains, okay, and everything in between, all right? Today, we're going to talk about something that's the elephant in the room, okay? Katana, all right? Do I have to bring it back? I put it over there. I don't think I have to bring it back. I think we I think we, we understand what katana is. I mean, come on. It cuts through <laughs> the economy. It gives it the, it gives it that, uh, <laughs> it gives it that MR, you know what I mean? All right, not a not applicable. Okay, <laughs> Mister Not Applicable. That's what it does. <laughs> it cuts its it cuts its you know what in half. Okay, just like the spikes, if you know what I mean. Okay, it likes to spike it up, if you know what I mean. Okay. Uh, anyways, so the last year we went through a lot, like I said before, and uh, we had year two of the katana, cutting through, and now we in phase. What I would call uh, this year was the was the dark was the dark ritual, okay? Where people getting waxed and they putting it in their body, and a lot of side effects occurred. And uh, unfortunately, a lot of people are not with us th today, okay? And that's unfortunate. And uh, rest in peace to those people in there. And uh, my heart goes out to those families now. But again, for the most part of those people, it's a choice. Everything in life is a choice. Remember why I said last episode, talked about the shadow pill? what I say? Go your own way. Go on your own path. It's your life, okay? Your body, your choice, okay? Use it, all right? Use it. 
That's why I made it. You see, everything comes together, man. Everything is a puzzle piece. It's all coming together, all right? It's all coming together. My plan's coming together. Soon I'll have a rocket ship, and we'll go out into space. Anyways, <laughs> that's a joke. That's a joke. If anyone uh, from the uh, from Uncle Sam's listening, uh, I'm not doing anything like that. Uh, <laughs> or am I? No, I'm not. I'm not. I promise. Don't get me in trouble. Uh, but seriously, though. Okay, we got something I want to cover that's a big elephant in the room about this whole thing, okay? And that's what I call fallout, okay? Big old karma kicked in today, and I'm loving it. There was two news stories that was about basically the news and uh, how they were not making enough money this year. They were not. So let's go ahead and get into that. Let me see if I can just do this without getting doxxed. Let me see. Let me see. I'm going to hit. Is this the button I want to hit? Is this the button I want to hit? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and now. And oh, I didn't turn this up. I messed up. It's actually this button and that button. You're not supposed to see that. Forget what I just did. Let's try it again. <laughs> Let's try it again. Uh, duh, 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 duh. okay, okay, all right, okay, okay. Let's try this now. Okay, you're not supposed to see that. Why is that not showing? What is going on? Oh. Okay, that didn't. That's weird. Why is it not showing? No. That's weird. Let's, uh. Ah! I did it. Okay, sorry. Sorry for that uh, weird delay. So here is what happened, okay? So outlets are hurt by dwindling public interest in news in 2021. Now, I'm not going to read certain words, obviously, to, you know, because the algo, Mr. Algo, okay, so here we go. I'm just going to cover the basics, and that is basically they're getting hurt by the uh, people not uh, tuning in. I told you, the Rugathon is taking over, so... New York AP, AP, I, I always, Associated Press, oh, that's right, that's right, it's been, a, it's been a while since I, like, read Boomer News, like, like, all the way through, uh, the president election, oh, not saying that word, and reckon, reckoning were stories that drove intense interest and engagement to news outlets in 2020, to a large degree, 2021 represented the inevitable hangover. No, it didn't. It did not. No, it didn't. See how you see how they coping? You see how they coping? No, no, no. I know what happened. And you and I both know what happened, guys. Here's what happened. Okay? People have a limit of depression they can receive. Especially when that information hurts them in their personal life. When you have events on the news hit people daily, on a daily basis, hit people in their freedoms of what they can do, right? Freedom of commerce, you know, freedom of pursuit of happiness, you know, traveling, doing activities, going on dates, etc., etc., right? Uh, and then also their employment, where they get sick, they get hurt, they have to deal with the drama of, you know, lying long, long life, uh, you know, uh, long life, whatever, um, you know, issues because of the, uh, the, the, uh, the wax, it's, 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 it's just compounding, you know, and people don't want to tune in as a reminder of all the problems in their life. People tune in to avoid that. When they see bad news, they see bad news about other people. That's what they want to see. They don't want to see bad news that has to do with them. Okay, I almost pointed at me, but that's not me. I'm not in that position. I don't watch the news. So you have to understand that. These people, they're like, oh, it's the, it's this other problem. No, it's not another problem. It's you. You're the problem. You guys are the problem. You're, you misused. You misused your ability. And people use their ability to walk away. They walked away. You know, the big rugathon is happening everywhere. That's why I call it a rugathon. It don't stop. The rugging continueth, okay? So saith we all, okay? Put it in the book, okay? Put it in the book of yin, okay? Book of yin, 
page one, okay, paragraph one. Let the ruggeth begin. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm sorry. Don't use that. <laughs> I'm sure someone's gonna rug someone else and then they're gonna quote me. No, don't do that. Okay, I don't. I don't. Con I don't condone it. Uh, that's a no-no thing. Various metrics illustrate the dwindling popularity of news content. Cable news networks were the main form of, of, of evening entertainment for millions of Americans last year. In 2021, weekday prime time viewership dropped 38 tr percent. Listen, I want to show you guys something. When I read this, this is how I felt. Okay, this is how I felt. All right, and I and I heard this. I, I saw this news story and at work, and someone asked me, "What? Well, what did? What? What made you? What made you laugh, Ian?" And I and this is what I said. This is me. If I speak, I am in, in big trouble. In big trouble. And I don't want to be in big trouble. <laughs> that was me. You know what I mean? I, I couldn't I couldn't say anything. I couldn't say anything. If I said something, I was going to be in trouble. Because it, it, it just come out of you. You know what I mean? It's coming out of you. You know, the truth. The truth is so addictive. Okay? You want to tell people the truth. You want people to live a free life. So when you want to tell them something that's real, and it comes out, it comes in your chest right here. You just, it's like, it's like, it's like something possesses you. You know, to tell somebody the truth. You know, to really let them know, to just let them know it's over, bro. It's over, right? It's not like, oh, you know, it's a theory, whatever. You know, it's on a board. No, it's here. It's now. Today, it's over. It been over, and that's something people have to wake up to now, and it's gonna be even worse. Just like the food in the re in the grocery store, yeah, people are paying way more money for their food, way more money for their gas. It's gonna be an unavoidable reality. Most people are still sleeping, bro. You guys have to understand, the majority of people are sleepers, okay? And you can't wake up everybody. Most people will never wake up. They'll never smell the roses. They'll never look at the alarm clock. They won't realize they're in their bed. They think they're in a whole other world. Okay? They think the world's like this when really the world's like this. Okay? You know what I mean? So, anyways, let's keep going. The decline. Oh, I think I missed a spot. In 2020, I missed a spot. In 2021, week, weekday prime time viewership dropped 38%. And at, at I'm not going to say their name. And 34% at this other uh, channel. And 25% at this other channel. This is the future, by the way. <laughs> Welcome. According to, Neil, to the Nielsen Company, the decline was less steep, but still significant at broadcast television evening newscasts. 12% at ABC's, I know I can say that word, World's News Tonight, and CBS Evening News. 14% at NBC's Nightly News, Nielsen said. The... Uh, 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 the uh, the the emperor guy that people God Emperor guys what they call him I don't know man I call him Warhammer that's his name now okay the Warhammer era <laughs> I love that name now that's a that's really good uh the, the, the almost got in trouble the the, the Warhammer era saw explosive subscriber growth for <laughs> sub digital. News sites like the New York Times and Washington Post. Yet readers aren't spending much time. What? Oh, much time there. Sorry, I, I like missed the spot. Missed the spot. Uh, Comscore said the what is Comscore? I've never heard of that. Uh, Comscore said the number of unique visitors to the post sites was down forty four percent in November compared to November 2020, and down 34% at the times. Okay, okay, okay. Let's keep going. Is that it? Is that all there is? Oh, you got the whole thing. Oh, you're going to keep going? Oh, no, we don't need to keep going. I just want to... What? Let me scroll to this part. I got to scroll to this part. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I did not pre-read this. Okay, I'm sorry. This is the one time I don't pre-read. Uh, ooh, I want to read this part. So both that news company... And that other plant news company face, uh, you know, they're both plant people, so whatever, face key programming decisions in the new year. Uh, that plant company must replace its popular host, uh, 
Chris Cuomo, who was uh, terminated after it was revealed how he helped his brother through a scandal. Ooh. And ooh, that other uh, company must help Brian Williams in its lineup and will most likely be uh, see its popular personality. Uh, oh, okay, I can say her name. I think I can say her name. I'll say Meadow. Meadows cut back on her hours. Good, good, good. I mean, make make money and save money, not waste money and spend money. That's stupid. What are you doing? Um, although the usage of the Times digital site is down, the company passed 8 million subscribers and is on pace to grow further. But duh, people would rather, like, here's the thing. As much as people don't like the New York Times, the New York Times quite often has straightforward, a good story. Like, I hate to say it. I hate to say it. Sometimes they got a story that you're just like, yeah, I agree. That happened. Like a story you follow and they happen to cover it. You look at it, you go, yeah, I agree. That's 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 exactly what happened. Or maybe you watch, you saw something happen in your city and you witnessed something and they were reporting on it and they reported exactly to a T and you're just like, all right, so these guys are, you know, they're not perfect. They're not, you know, they by no means, <laughs> period. They're like that neutral zone. Like, like they kind of mess up a lot and then they, they, they do a good story every now and then. It's like, it doesn't really even out, but whatever. Anywho, Doctor said the Times has done an effective job at diver diversifying beyond politics. That's, yeah, yeah, I see sometimes I see them do that. Most notably with its wire cutter services of consumer recommendations. Okay? You can read this more in the... Uh, I'll put that in the show notes. You can read more about it. I don't want to read all of it because of, obviously, copyright infringement. I don't want to get in any issues with that. Uh, I just wanted to cover the basics. Let me scroll up so we don't get in trouble with that. Welcome to the future. Uh, my point of this story, I'm going to put this away. Let me just put this away, okay? I'm going to put this away. Give me one second. Uh, my point of this whole thing, okay? My point of this whole thing is people getting hurt, okay? These companies have downsides and all their little... Uh, special little, 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 little friends in the front were getting e out of here. They were just getting them up out of here. Okay, they were just straight up eating them out of the office. Okay, they say get out of here. We can't afford you right now, and I'll see you later. They were used, in my personal opinion. In my personal opinion, they were used. They were considered useful, right? They were a, there was a utility for them. Right. As soon as there was no utility for them and they have the, you know, uh, 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 President Frankenstein on the on the on the throne there. That's when you knew the reality what they were going to do. We don't need you no more. Yeet. Get on out of here. Just get out of here. It'll kick them. Kick them out of there. You know what I mean? Uh, and that's just the reality of this. This harsh business, man. They're going to use you, and they're going to lose you. And then now you're done. Now you've been used, and now you can't even get a job in the industry because of the bad name you got from the place that you just got kicked from, okay? They won't see you as neutral. Now, does that mean some places will want you for that? Sure, maybe. I don't know. My point of this whole story is the news people finally getting hit. And it's interesting to me. Now, does that mean every single person is going to get hit? Probably not. Probably not. But it is a start, in my opinion. I'm very bullish on this. Very bullish, guys. I think uh, there's going to be some amazing uh, fallout from all this. I think maybe 50-50 there will be um, some sort of evening out later on as if uh, if this ever goes back to normal. It'll even out and go back to normal slowly but surely. But right now, it's hard to like visualize the future right now of what that looks like because of how everything changed in the past year. I mean, remote work is now normal. It used to be a big privilege. You had to fight to get remote work, like really fight. And even teleworking or whatever, whatever you're doing at home to like work for your business or your job or whatever is um, more complicated because it's like it's its own special thing and special schedule. It's not really something you are assigned for or whatever. Um, it, it's just, it's messy. 
it's this whole thing's been messy. The last two years has been messy. I think everyone can agree on that. I think a lot of the family struggles as far as like relationships and um, you know marriages and you know parenting has been put into such high you know st- stress that I don't foresee people's um, moving on mentally from this ever again. In my personal opinion, I think people will be stuck on this. There will be like a new generation. We'll be the people will be called the whatever, the katana generation. Who knows? Uh, oh man, I won't say what I wanted to say. I was gonna say something else. I was like, mm, no, don't do that. Uh, anyways, so there is one more thing we could cover. I don't know if it's still around. Uh, let me check. Uh, no, I don't have it anymore. My apologies there. So, anyways. Long story short, this year has been an interesting year. I hope you have used it in the last year before that. I hope you utilized it to its maximum and that you actually got up, you know, at the end of it. You had leveled yourself up in some way or at least have achieved a new freedom in another way. Like you were able to start a business and it's successful and now you have your freedom or you were able to move up in a different position somewhere in a different company or whatever, whatever it may be, okay? Um, it's because it's tough, man. You have to be elevating. This is more proof than ever that you have to be elevating for your own self. You can't just be static and not achieving anything else because this the dollar's going up. You, you know, expenses are going up. Uh, the, the service quality is going down. The reliable people without complaining is going down. It's 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 scary. It's a scary future, man. Um, but I'm still bullish because um, I believe in myself. You know, you gotta have some little belief in yourself. Um, I'm also bullish on the fact that um, the marketplace, uh, even though the economy itself, even though the economy is is having like a rough turnabout, you know, you have still options in like the shadow verse to do other things. You know, uh, like APY farming and everything. Um, but yeah, man, I'll, let's talk more tonight at nine, uh, not at nine. I don't know what time we'll, we'll do it. I'm hoping, I, I'm hoping to shoot for like something a little later, maybe 10, um, maybe 10 or something. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I'm, I, I'll, I'll make an announcement in the telegram. If you're f- subscribed to it, great. If not, no big deal. It's not a big deal. You guys will get to see the live stream anyway. Uh, Even if it's after the fact, it's not the end of the world. Thank you again for your time. See you next time. And, oh, by the way, look at that. (laughs) It looks like something from the uh, 1980s or something, right? It looked like something out of the 1980s. I thought so. It was like uh, I was having flashbacks of the the, uh, Hawaiian Punch, like, logo, the Hawaiian Punch mascot and everything because they always had, like, little... Like uh, I always saw little bottles at my um, at my grocery store, my corner store, uh, with like that kind of art style, you know. So, anyways, that's enough for me. You guys have a great day. God bless you and happy New Year.